to August 31st and my boyfriend and I are actually doing a boat shoot out at Cocoa Beach, Florida and I'm super excited. Um, we have a friend who works for a company and so every now and then she'll ask us if we want to do a boat shoot. He drives a boat. I sit on the boat basically all day. So since I know I'm going to be sitting all day, I decided to get up a little early. We're going to be heading out around 7.15, but I wanted to get some steps in because I know I'll be sitting on a boat basically all day. So not mad about it. Just got to hit my step goal. So here we are. It is 6.40, or sorry, 5.40. And yeah, so I'm going to try and film a little bit, take you through a little day. That's unusual. It's not like this is the everyday thing. Um, this happens probably once or twice a year that we get to do something like this. So yeah, I'm going to try and film a little and get some beautiful shots out on the ocean and show you what it's like. Um, they did tell us that the meals would be paid for today um, and tomorrow, but I have no idea what they consist of. So I did bring my own snacks that are high in protein, um, some rice cakes, just to have on hand if like, you know, it's always good to have a backup. Like I'm not in prep right now. I'm two months po post-show in improvement season. So I'm not terribly worried, but we still have goals to achieve. So I want to make sure that I'm fueling properly, giving my body what it needs, and getting my, reaching my protein goals. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to try and take you through that. And um, yeah, I hope, it's, hope you have fun. <laughs> So it is about 8.15 now and we were supposed to be on the boat at 7.15 but one of the boat trailers, I guess they had some issues this morning so we're actually not going to go out until noon. So I'm enjoying some more coffee and we're just hanging out. Um, we're in Cocoa Beach area, Cocoa Beach, Florida. So we might go check out the beach before, go for a little walk. I got about 50 minutes in this morning of just walking so my steps are pretty high. We're at almost 8,000 steps by 8.15, so I feel good because I definitely want to hit my 10K range this morning, or, you know, for the day, so I definitely did that, or I will. Um, but yeah, so right now we are just chilling, and I cannot wait to get out on the water because it's a, well, it's really nice right now. We'll see if it continues. I'm not sure. But um, this is my attire, so a little bit different than the stage bikini. I am wearing just a nice flowy shirt. No sparkles today, but yeah, it's really cozy. And this is like my go-to. It's got a hoodie. We are good to go. This is actually OWC, Orlando Wakeboard Complex. Water sports, sorry. Um, but yeah, so um, yeah, we're just gonna be chilling and um, I hope to get some footage soon of the water, so keep you in the loop for the day.
feel that out. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, my wife. Good morning. Uh, it is day two, and my finger's in here. So it is day two. CJ left, he's doing an early shoot this morning, um, and I don't have to show up until 2.45, and it is currently 7.15 right now. So I am just laying in bed, I put some clothes on, um, cause when he got up, I obviously got up cause I don't sleep in. I mean, 6.15 was sleeping in for me, so that was fantastic. We went out to dinner last night, I got a bison burger, feel really good this morning. Um, we went out with the crew and it was fun, but you know, we got to bed at a decent hour. Um, so now I am just deciding, um, where I want to go for breakfast. Um, if I just want to do something downstairs, but they didn't really have a good selection downstairs. I could do protein oatmeal cause I do have my own better oats packs with me, protein powder, but, um, I'm just debating cause I'm kind of feeling like, a bigger breakfast, like a egg whites or something. Um, I don't know. So I'm going to decide on that. And then I did find a gym here. It's on Merritt Island. Um, so I'm going to check that out um, here in a little bit. But I do have to run to Ron John's and return one of the shirts I got from yesterday because we didn't end up wearing it. So. I'm just gonna return that and yeah, um, we'll be back on the boat at 2.45 today. I'm excited, but I am so burnt and shiny. It's ridiculous, my lines are showing. Uh, so fried, um, but it's okay. Uh, it will turn into a tan soon here. But yeah, so I will take you along for day two. Um, and I, I checked out the pit photos on this gym and it looks pretty cool. So I'm excited to check it out. So I'll try to bring you along. Bye. All right. We are checking out Southern Charm Cafe. It was a recommendation from the front desk and I was one of the ones that stood out to me on Yelp. So we're going to go in here, check out the omelets, maybe get a side pancake. I don't know. Cause I need some good protein and um, some carbs before I even consider going to the gym right now. So I am gonna go in here and get some breakfast. I think it will be a good timing for me to go return this shirt to Ron John because they open up at nine and then I can hang out at the hotel or just go straight to the gym just depending on how I feel. Today is just, this morning is just kind of a go with the flow kind of vibe so I'll take you along with me to Southern Charm. We made it to the beach. I'm hoping you guys can even hear me right now because it's windy and sunny and beautiful right now. Um, it's about nine o'clock and I just had breakfast and I'm just going for a little stroll on the beach. Um, it was about a five minute drive to park somewhere. So getting some steps in this morning outside and just enjoying the moment. Um, this is rare that I make it to the beach, especially during the week. So I'm enjoying it. Um, feeling really happy right now. Um, so yeah, after this, I'm just going to make my way to the gym, get a good lift in, go back to the hotel and make sure I check out on time. 
checkouts at noon, but overall I'm feeling really good right now. Um, I ate my breakfast and I ate until I was full. Like I listened to my body and did not feel like I had to finish everything on my plate, which I didn't and it was amazing and that's progress. That is progress and improvement and that's what improvement season is for is to make, you know, tiny improvements outside of just, you know, hitting the stage. Um, so I feel good because um, I'm one of those that likes to eat everything on their plate and feel like it's like if, I'm, if I don't, I'm wasting it. But I didn't feel that need today. I just ate until I was full and, you know, I was like, okay, I'm satisfied. I'm going to go do, go on to the rest of my day because guess what? I can eat later when I'm hungry again. So listening to your body, listening for those cues is super important. Um, that's kind of what I want to focus on in this improvement season is, you know, hitting my macros, but also just being, being more aware of the cues with my body and when I'm full, because like I said, I'll eat everything on my plate usually. So yeah, feel good. Um, and I'm going to enjoy the rest of this morning a little more just on improving other areas of your life in improvement season. I think these are the moments we need to do more of and appreciate more when we're stepping away from the stage. I know we're start talking about it more and more, um, how important it is because, you know, being in a, you know, prepping for so long, kind of, you are so focused on that one goal to, you know, do well on stage that these areas of your life just get kind of neglected, um, you know, work, your family relationships, um, being able to build muscle in the gym. I mean, at that point, you're just maintaining, trying to maintain the muscle you have, and it's very hard to build muscle and it's a calorie deficit. So, you know, just improving these other areas and appreciating this improvement season. Those are my goals for, you know, this time. And it's really, it's really helping me to step up. It's easier for me to step away from the stage when I think this way, because, you know, I love to compete. I love the grind the hustle and you know getting up on stage and just doing my best and you know it's hard to step away especially coming so close so many times to getting earning a pro card but you know I needed a break and this is just really showing me how much I needed it how much I appreciate this time um, you know I'm starting to hit PRs in the gym not like my heaviest PRs, but since I've been in, in improvement season, they've been hitting, I've been hitting PR, so it's been really rewarding. And this is just my little treat on top. That is just amazing. I mean, wow, uh, I miss the beach so much. I live in Florida and I maybe get to the beach twice a year. It seems like nowadays, I used to live at the beach and now I am, yeah, never here. So I'm going to enjoy this time.
so I just finished up at the gym. Oh my gosh, I got such a good pump in today. Um, did some, I'll probably post my workout because I only got a couple clips. Um, really cool gym, like old school gym. Yeah, it was fun. Um, so I um, will post some of my videos I took. I did do um, deadlifts with the trap bar. I got it to 210 for six reps, which I'm super pumped about. Um, you know, just baby steps, just getting up there. Um, and I did not record it, but I finally hit 40 pounds um, shoulder presses which um, I have not been able to do in like almost a year now. Like I've been, my goal is to get um, 45 pound dumbbells and um, up in shoulder presses, but I've gotten to 40 two months post show and I am pumped. So two big accomplishments there. Um, but yeah, I did shoulders and glutes today did some abs um so now i'm it's one o'clock i am driving um but it is one o'clock i'm gonna go grab some poke because um we went there yesterday so i know it's good um and they do have shrimp i don't know if i'll do shrimp or if i'll just stick with the salmon um which was really good yesterday um i'm gonna do that and then meet up with everybody for the shoot at 2.45 and then we might be on the water until about 8 o'clock tonight and then have to drive back to Orlando which is a bit less than an hour drive but yeah I have a feeling I'm going to be exhausted soon so I'm going to get some carbs and protein in me and yeah I'll try and get some shots on the water again um see what else I can get but that this has been a fun time. You know, it's nice. It's different. It's not my everyday. Um, but I thought I'd bring you all along. And sorry if it's bumpy and you can't hear me. Um, you know, thought I'd bring you along for the ride. So here we are. I'm going to keep driving because I don't like talking on the phone while I'm driving. So bye.